December 4th, 2022. We have keepers here. We have Brogan, named by a person who bought him and was supposed to take him to Florida. And, uh, like, so he's been sold once. I can sell him again for less, but I do need to sell him. He's out of um, trouble in Bogan. He's probably 150 pounds. He's probably gonna do that to you the whole time. Unless, I don't well, I don't know that it shows much though. Let's let's let him do something else. Athletic, very human centric. He's about 12% Congo, I think. Not very independent. All about people. We actually worked with him more than we normally do dogs we know we're not going to keep because we wanted to get him ready for this transit with a professional shipper. So he's least trained and yada yada. Very athletic dog. His cellmate there is Iris. She was my keeper from Sticky. She's got a, a hobble. Her left rear is hobbled. If she doesn't get better in about a month, she'll be for sale too. And that's kind of how I do it. I don't, you know, I don't need to go spend money to know what or why. Either you get better or you get gone. Um, and they love me for that sort of attitude at the vet's office. And all the moral grandstanders can kiss my ass because you don't pay for my dog food. And you're not the one that puts a dog down and all the rest, you know. I really have no tolerance for people sitting in judgment. That's none of their business. But that's her reality, any reality. If you've got a bad wheel, you're either going to get better or you're going to get gone. You're going to get a new home or you're going to get home in the country. As in, in it. So I hope she gets better. But um, it's been a while. I'll give her another month. He's good. He didn't have any issues physically. Really, any anyway. Easy. Easy to manage, very little independence. Over here we have dogs I'm not trying to sell, so why bother? This is Stogan. This is my keeper from Sticky. The first letter, he's great. He's a brother to Iris. Hey, buddy, you see that face? Yeah, you're a thinking dog. Yes, you're a handsome thinking dog. I like to believe that when I look a dog in the eyes, I know who's thinking. He's not all there. He's, he is a thinking dog. Good looking dog. Pretty close to idea. For what we're, what we're trying to do, um, I like a taller, more athletic dog than a lot of guys in the quote-unquote band dog world. It's I guess where it put me. Um, but, you know, that's a more functional build than even Country, who I love. He's 160 pounds and he gasses out. Come on, man, that, that's not showing us anything. He's sweet. He needs an owner. Brogan, you're good. He's like, what happened to the love? Care a shit about that stick. <laughs> There's no retriever in there. He's all about love. He needs love. He needs a home. I'm dealing. Somebody come buy this dog because uh, he's got no future here in the breeding program. He's related to everything and his mixture's not clearly defined to work in any of the three categories that I'm trying to pursue, even if he wasn't related, which he is. So he, he never had a chance, but he was my favorite from his litter and he stuck around. And these big dogs don't move. Uh, if you follow the program, you know I've been trying to sell this guy for a while. And uh, I think, yeah, it's, it's time. So I'll make somebody a deal on this guy. Come get him.